Okay, so today we are going to get started doing a pumpkin. Um, and then we're going to draw a pumpkin on a white piece of paper. And then we're going to cut it out and glue it on a black piece of paper and finish it with oil pastels. So the first step to drawing a pumpkin is go to the, our papers wide, okay, side to side. And we're going to go to the top. Hold on, let me make sure it's not blurry. We're going to go to the top of the page and do the little stem of our pumpkin. And then we're going to do a big oval. It doesn't need to be perfect, but I don't want a little tiny guy. It needs to fill up most of your page. Most of your page should be filled with this pumpkin, okay? So once you've got your oval, we're going to do curved lines going down, starting at the center, curving around, and going down to the center at the bottom. I'm sorry you guys, it keeps not focusing. Maybe if we do put that there, we'll focus on that. Okay. Then we do one going this way. Then we do one more going this way. And one more going this way. Okay, we've got our pumpkin. Now that we have our pumpkin, we're going to take a Sharpie. Oh, this is a brown one. A black one. And trace it in Sharpie. So everything we just did in pencil. We trace a marker. All right, then we take our big eraser and erase any pencil marks that you see. Okay. Okay. Now, we're going to have three color crayons dark orange, light orange, and yellow. Okay. So it's on there it says red orange I don't know if you can see that red orange orange yellow okay so we're gonna do dark orange first the red orange okay and we're gonna color just on the outside of each of these we're not coloring on the inside we're going around the outside. Uh-oh, if your crayon breaks, just, that's okay. Okay, so along the outside of this and along the outside of the black line this way. So it's almost like a moon. We're coloring the outside of almost a moon, okay? I'm gonna do a little bit extra at the top and at the bottom. So the tips are all colored in and the outline of it. Now do the same thing here. The tips and the outside. Okay, we're going to do that. I'm just going to go fast. When we're coloring, always color for this. This is a long skinny piece, so we're always coloring up and down. Don't color side to side. This isn't going to look as good. Always color up and down. Now, if we had a very short, wide thing, we would color side to side. But since it's a long, skinny piece, we're going to color up and down. Okay. So we're coloring on both sides of this line. We're coloring in the tips. If you get a little over the line, don't worry about it. We're going to be cutting these out. So, all right. Now you're going to take your regular orange. So not the red orange, but the regular orange. 
and we're going to color a little bit more of those tips. And a little bit more of the sides, but we're going to leave the middle white. So, a little bit more of the tips, a little bit further out for the tips, and then a little bit more on the sides, but we leave some in the middle. We're going to do this to each one of them. I might overlap my red-orange just a little bit. Tips, tips, a little bit more of the side. But I'm leaving a little white spot in each one of these sections. We're not coloring the whole thing in. Tips, tips, a little bit more of the side. Curving with the pumpkin. Okay, now I switch to my yellow. My yellow gets colored in the white that I have left. So this is called value. It's going from dark to light. And it's going to make our pumpkin look 3D. So in the white spot, we color it in yellow. Now we're going to take a green and we're going to color in our stem green. Okay. Once you have that, we're going to take our scissors. We use our thumb in the small hole, our bunny ears in the big hole. We hold it like this and we very carefully and very slowly are going to cut out our pumpkin. We turn the paper, not the scissors. If you have to take your scissors out and re-put it back in, you can do that. We always turn the paper not our scissors. And it's okay if you see a little white. We're just going to try our best. Go slow. Okay. So now we've got our pumpkin. We're going to take a glue stick, flip it over, share, because we don't have a ton of glue sticks. Okay. We don't put glue on the black paper. We're going to put glue on the pumpkin, on the back of the pumpkin, okay? And we want to make sure we're not rolling it up really high. We just roll it up a little, otherwise you get glue everywhere. Then we turn it over, put it in the middle of your black piece of paper, and press down. All right, we're also going to put our name on the back of this. We're going to flip it over and put our name you could maybe use the yellow crayon. Maybe use the yellow crayon. And your group number goes in the circle. So if you're group one, you put a one. If you're group two, you put a two. Don't put my name. This is my name. You put your name, okay? Then we're going to take those greens and draw some leaves. Just all around, anywhere you want on this. Draw some leaves. And if you want, you can use a lighter green and do some lighter green leaves too. And then we're going to do some little curly Q vines. And last but not least, I'm going to give you an oil pastel, a white, and we're going to do a little moon. Thank you. 